Hey guys, and welcome back in the kitchen. You're cooking with Paula on Team McClary Cooks. So today, you guys, we are making some simple baked chicken that you don't want to miss. Stay tuned for the ingredients. Here are the ingredients we will be using. I have some chicken thighs, some parsley, some roasted garlic and red bell pepper spice blend, some sazon, some garlic and onion powder, and you guys, we will be using some roasted red bell pepper gourmet butter. Let's get into it. All right, you guys, let's get this chicken seasoned just like so. The first thing I'm going to go in with is some garlic powder. Let's go in very generously, you guys. Then I'm going to go in with some onion powder. I'm going to hit that baby up just like so. Yep. Then we're going to go in with some sazon. Try not to go too heavy handed because your chicken will turn a dark orange color. Okay, gonna go in just like so. The next thing we are gonna go in with is the star of the show, the roasted garlic and red bell pepper spice blend. Let's go in there just like that, you guys. Please season to taste to your own liking, whatever is pleasing to your palate, okay? If this seems like it's too much, you guys, make it less for yourself, all right? Now, what we're gonna do now is take our fork and flip these babies over just like so, so we can coat the skin and the other side. I'm getting my pan all dirty, but it's okay. Let's get them done just like so, babe. Let's get that skin smoothed out nice and, and even. Okay. Get them nice and even, you guys. Nice and even. It's going in there just like so. This chicken is about to be bomb, so I hope you guys have these spices. Or if you can go out and get these spices, you guys, you're gonna be missing something if you don't try it. Okay, let's get it done just like so. Now that we have all of our babies flipped over, we gotta go back in with the seasoning part again. All right, we're gonna go back in with that roasted garlic and red bell pepper spice blend just like this. We're gonna season backwards, you guys, so that we can have all of our seasonings even out. Let's get them just like so. Back on with our sazon. Get that nice golden brown color on our chicken. Let's go back in with our onion and garlic powder just like so. Gonna season those babies up. All right, you guys, now is the time I'm gonna add my parsley on there, okay? We're gonna go down just like that with our parsley because guess what? It has no flavor, but it will make this chicken look amazing in the end okay it's going there just like that let's get a good bit on this one right here on the side bam now i have some gourmet butter here i'm going to go in with the three roasted red bell pepper gourmet butter pieces i'm going to go here let's go there you guys i'm going to break this one in half Stick it right here and I'm gonna stick that other one right there okay you guys we're gonna get some water to put down in the bottom of this pan and then we're gonna stick this baby in the oven at 425 degrees for about 40 minutes all right you guys I'm back with my water just like so let's take this fork and go down in the bottom with it Try your best not to pour it on top of your chicken because you don't want to wash your flavor off, okay? Look at that. Move that chicken around, you guys, to get that water all in between those pieces of chicken, all right? Now, for us to stick it into the oven at 425 degrees for about 35 to 40 minutes, you guys. We will see you back in that time. All right, you guys, we are back after 40 minutes. What I'm gonna do now is take a spoon, you guys, and put our drippings from our chicken 
I'm going to go ahead and make it moist again, baby. I'm going to use all of that butter and that broth to make this baby juicy. Okay? You want to keep your broth in there to keep your chicken nice and moist. All right? Let's go ahead and put that all over our chicken just like so. Look at that, baby. And there's nothing like baked chicken with a little bit of a crunchy skin. Let's go ahead and put that on there like said. Ooh, yes. I wish you guys could smell this. I wish we had smell a vision or something. Man, look at this. Okay. Now, if you want sauce, you can put sauce on that baby, but I'm not gonna put any on mine because I want all the flavor of that roasted garlic and bell pepper, okay? What I'm gonna do now is sprinkle some green onions on that baby just like so. Come on, baby, get on that chicken. Bam. We're gonna leave her just like that. Let me give you a close up before we go. Look at that, you guys. Roasted garlic and red bell pepper blend baked chicken with a bit of a crunchy skin, you guys. I am ready to dig in. I hope you like what you see here. Until next time, we'll see you soon. Bye.